Lumion allows you to create movies based off of what's considered a camera path. In this instance, we're going to start a movie right where we're at, and then we're going to take snapshot photos all the way around till we reach this side of the building where my cursor is moving. To do this, over toward the right-hand side, down toward the bottom, we can see what looks like a piece of film or a film clip. This is the movie button, and if you select on the movie button, you'll then have the ability to take a movie. We can see that right now the number one is highlighted. If it isn't, make sure to select on that. And what we want to do is record a movie. From here, we need to take individual snapshots to generate this movie from. I like where we're standing right now for the beginning of the movie. So select where it says take photo to take a photograph of this location. The next thing we want to do is move over to the left and take another photo. To do this, we're going to hold down the letter A on the keyboard. It'll scroll us over, let go of the letter A, then we also want this building to be centered in our picture. So to do that, we're going to hold down the right mouse button and gently move the mouse toward the right hand side. Once you have the building centered in the scene, once again, take the photo. Do this again, hold down the letter A, move over to the left hand side, let go, right click with your mouse, while holding that right mouse button down, gently move over toward the right hand side, center the building in the frame, take another photo. We're going to do this two more times. Hold down the letter A. I also want to mention that as the letter A is being held down, you can also hold down that right mouse button to spin the building around. Once you get to this location, we're going to take yet another photo. And finally, I'd like to take one more photo further on around, holding down the letter A, holding down the right mouse button, gently moving the mouse. And this one I'd like to take from a little higher in the air. So I'm going to hold down the letter Q, go up higher in the air. If you go too high, you can hold down the letter E, and that will lower you. Once you get to a nice elevation, take another photo. To preview your movie, you can click on the play button over on the far left. And this will now generate a smooth movie transitioning from snapshot to snapshot that you just took. The purpose of creating a camera path is to generate a movie based off of the different camera locations that you've taken pictures from. You'll notice that this will continue to replay itself again and again and again. This is also a good way that if you want to start to discuss a building, you're talking to people, you're projecting this up on a wall, you can have it continue to run this animation again and again as you're discussing your project. Now I'm going to click on the play button, which is now a pause button, to pause the movie where it's at. To finish this off, I'm going to click on the check mark over toward the right hand side. If I wanted to finalize this and complete generating this movie, I could do that as well. And that's just by clicking here where it says save movie. Select on that. You can adjust any settings that you want as far as frames per second, the final quality. You can click on OK, start the export process. Then you can save this movie out. And in this case, I'm just going to call this movie one. Select on the save button. And now it's going to save that movie out and it'll be its own individual file that you can click on once you're out of Lumion and play it at some later time.